Hello everybody, welcome back to the Art Playground. Today we are going to use a new stamp I got from Pink Ink Designs. It is a Decadence Frame Series. And this one is PI076. So we're going to be using this. I have my Stillman Burn Journal. A stamping block. I have some WOW embossing powders and my pen and then I'm going to be using watercolors. And then we're going to create a little character inside the frame. So are you ready? Here we go. And the WOW embossing pad. Um, product code WV02. I'm going to ink this up. I want to make sure it's well inked. This is the Metallic Gold Rich Regular WC04R Opaque. Okay, let's get some watercolors. Now I'm just using my favorite watercolors. These are a lot of Daniel Smith's and a few other brands, but mostly Daniel Smith's that I've built up over the, a few years. <laughs> it has taken a while, but I'm just gradually painting in a little girl here, kind of my little Mary Antoinette version, but with blue hair. I just keep building and building, seeing what colors play well together. And now I'm going to go ahead and use my embossing pen and my Candy Floss Wow Embossing Powder. I'm going to use it on her cheeks and her little tiny <laughs> lips. I was going to try and say a different name for them, but her little, her little pucker. That's the word I was thinking of. Her cute little pucker. She's so darling. Use some candy floss on her lips and cheeks. That is WS two nine nine R. I'm going to use ice cream for the edge of the frame. It is. WS300R. I'm actually contemplating restamping the frame and using the sparkle on top of that as well. Do our best to line it up. Let's try it out. I think I might use the Pearl Gold Sparkle WS06R because it's transparent, so it will also show the gold in behind. I just love the look of pouring all the glitter on the page, so I thought it'd be fun to do a little reverse. <laughs> trick for you. Oh yes, darling. my magnifying glass because I want to try and get some dainty lashes. I do not have a fine point brush in here, but if you have one, that is what you should use. This was the Pigma BB from Sakura. Ooh, let's try the black. 
glue quick for another hair. This is Paper Mate Quick Dry. I'm going to give her some scribbles. Hair scribbles. To Ink Joy. Sparkle Pop. But Pentel as well. some blue sparkle in her hair. Little blue tiara. Could actually get some, I think it's still wet. If it's not, we can use a clear one, but let's put some cummerbund on a tiara. Cummerbund WS two <laughs> two eight four R. Some of them are hard to see. Oh, the sparkle pop pen did work. I'm going to use the embossing pen and just do some doodles for the same cummerbund color down here where it says fabulous darling. Let's do some little dots. And this would be a great page to write around if you like writing in your journals, even with a pink pen or a purple pen. Or like a brown sepia. Fabulous darling. There we go. We used <coughs> the wow embossing pad. We use the Wow Embossing Pen for the Wow colors. We use Cumberbund, Pearl Gold Sparkle, Candy Floss, Metallic Gold Rich Regular. I use my watercolors. I use the Pigma BB Sakura Brush Tip Pen. Paper mate, quick dry in light blue. And we'll grab the stamps. The Pink Ink Designs Decadence Frame Series. P one O P I O seven six. I'm missing anything, right? No, and the heat gun, of course. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you had fun. And I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, and bye-bye for now. See you soon. Thanks for watching.